One of the injured victims recovering in the hospital right now was working as a waitress at Bertucci's when she was attacked. 26 year old Sheena Savoy is pregnant. The grandmother of her unborn baby gave us this picture of Savoy today. And Eyewitness News reporter Jared Pliner spoke with her about the tragedy. He continues our live coverage with that interview from the mobile newsroom in Taunton. Mike Shannon, DA Tom Quinn says Arthur DeRosa was hospitalized on Monday night after family noticed he was acting and speaking irrationally. Out the next day, he stabbed two women in their home on Myrick Street, 80 year old Patricia Slavin, fatally before taking off for the mall. CJ Martin says she's praying tonight everything works out for 26 year old Sheena Savoy and Martin's unborn grandchild. I got a small family and it's going to be bigger, I hope. Authorities say Sheena Savoy was one of Arthur DeRosa's taunting victims Tuesday when DA Tom Quinn says the 28 year old stabbed Savoy, a waitress, at the Silver City Galleria's Bertucci's. A man died a hero, saving her. She's a beautiful person. Savoy was flown to Rhode Island Hospital where she was set to undergo surgery. Martin says she found out about Savoy's pregnancy just this morning. I called my son and I said, how is she? And he told me and he's like, do you mind if I tell my mother? And she must have said yes. Martin says she has nothing but ill feelings tonight for Arthur DeRosa and his family. I'm sorry. I hate him. They are messed up. They are full of it. And don't tell me he was crazy because if you knew this, you would have protected him. You would have protected us. You got two heroes and a lot of victims. This is where it all ended, but it seemingly started at a child soccer practice on Myrick Street. Police say DeRosa left. He got into a car. He crashed into a pickup. He stabbed the Slavens, attempted carjackings, and again died right here at the Silver City Galleria. Beyond apparent mental instability, no discernible motive tonight. Live in Taunton with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, I'm Jared Planter, Eyewitness News.